Welcome to 20 at Twilight, a weekly video post that provides a 20 minute guided meditation, a way of praying with scripture to conclude the day, focusing on and resting in the presence of God. I am Tracy Leslie, a certified spiritual director and senior pastor at Trinity United Methodist Church in downtown Lafayette. You, O oh Lord, are my lamp. My God, you make my darkness bright. Light and peace in Jesus Christ, our Lord. Let us pray. We praise you and thank you, O oh God, for you are without beginning and without end. Through Christ, you created the whole world. Through Christ, you preserve it. You made the day for the works of light and the night for the refreshment of our minds and bodies. Keep us from all harm. Guide us in your way. We belong to you, O Lord. Protect us by the power of your name. In Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. This Sunday is a special day. It's All Saints Day. In the church on All Saints Day, we remember and honor the lives of the saints. I always remind people that the biblical meaning of a saint is simply one who has placed their trust in Christ. In fact, we might say that saint is just another word for a Christian. But of course, on All Saints Day, we think specifically about those saints who have passed from this life into their eternal reward. So this evening we'll remember and give thanks for some of those saints. I'd invite you to close your eyes now and take a couple deep breaths, breathing in and out. In. and out. In and out. Now clear your mind of any lingering thoughts from the day. Feel your body soften and your tensions ease. Enter in to the mystery that that is the vast love and mercy of God. That love and mercy that surround and enfold you every day and every night. Hear this scripture that the Apostle Paul wrote to the Christians in Corinth. Listen, I will tell you a mystery. We will not all die, but we will all be changed in a moment, in the twinkling of an eye. When this perishable body puts on imperishability and this mortal body puts on immortality, then the saying that is written shall be fulfilled. Death has been swallowed up in victory. Where, O oh death, is your victory? Where, O oh death, is your sting? But thanks be to God who gives us the victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. This evening, I want to invite you to remember and give thanks to God for some of the special people who have shaped and influenced your life. I divided them into four categories. Someone who shaped your spiritual development. Someone who shaped your mental development. Someone who shaped your physical development. And someone who shaped your social development. 
As human persons, we are mind, body, and spirit engaging and relating to the world and the people around us. So this evening, we want to consider who are the people who have passed away, who contributed to your development that you would like to remember and honor this evening. I'm going to introduce those categories again, one at a time, and each time give you a couple minutes to think about them, to reflect on their lives, and to pray. Traditionally, a bell tolls for each saint on All Saints Day. So at the end of that two minutes, I will sound a bell. Then I'll offer a very short prayer on behalf of the one you remembered and honored. So take a moment to think about a saint, someone who has passed away, who contributed to your spiritual growth and development. Eternal God, you shared with us the lives of those we have named. Before they were ours, they were and eternally are yours. For all that they have given us to make us who we are. For that of them which still lives and grows in us. And for their life that in your love will never end. We give you thanks. Amen. Now take a moment to think about a saint, someone who has passed, who contributed to your mental development, your growth, and your learning.
eternal God, you shared with us the lives of these ones we have named. Before they were ours, they were and eternally are yours. For all that they have given us to make us who we are. For that of them which still lives and grows in us. And for their life that in your love will never end, we give you thanks. Amen. Now take a moment to think about a saint, someone who has passed, who contributed to your physical development, to your health, to your strength and well being, perhaps to some physical abilities that you developed. Eternal God, you shared with us the lives of these ones we have named. Before they were ours, they were and are eternally yours. For all that you have that they have given us to make us who we are, for that of them which still lives and grows in us, and for their life that in your love will never end, we give you thanks. And finally, take a moment to think about a saint, someone who has passed, who contributed to your social development, who modeled and taught you how to be in right relationship with others.
Jesus said, Very truly, I tell you, unless a grain of wheat falls into the earth and dies, it remains just a single grain. But if it dies, it bears much fruit. Let us continue to remember those who planted seeds within our lives and honor their memory with our good fruit. Mary Catherine Bateson wrote, Remember, dear friend, we live in a world that offers much in suffering, but also consolation. You will not always understand it yourself, but seek to love it and seek to love yourself and to be loved. Know that the God of love has created us all, guides us all, and wills to bring us all back to God's self, the source from whence we came. Listen, I will tell you a mystery. We will not all die, but we will all be changed in a moment, in the twinkling of an eye. When this perishable body puts on imperishability and this mortal body puts on immortality, then the saying that is written shall be fulfilled. Death has been swallowed up in victory. Where, O oh death, is your victory? Where, O oh death, is your sting? But thanks be to God who gives us the victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. Thanks be to God. Day is dying in the West. Heaven is touching earth with rest. Wait and worship while the night sets the evening lamps alight through all the sky. Almighty God, as evening shadows lengthen and day turns to night, be near to those who work or watch or weep this night and give your angels charge over those who sleep. Tend the sick, Lord Christ. Give rest to the weary. Bless the dying. Soothe the suffering. Pity the afflicted. Shield the joyous. And all for your love's sake. Eternal creator of light. Yours is the morning and yours is the evening. Draw us to yourself so there will be no darkness within us, that we may rest in the peace of God, Father, Son, and Spirit. Amen. <laughs>